you know, that's like the classic perception of it. You know, there's a, a dormant energy coming up from the bottom of the spine and lighting up the chakras. And in a way, yes, of course, that's true. But uh, I would like to reframe it just a bit and say that, you know, what this old science is about, really, what yogic science and meditation really is about is making the brain work normally and the dormant regions become awakened. The average human has about 3 to 5 percent of the brain working. So it's really a huge ancient technology of the mind. And as the body becomes prepared and develops further, then there's an increase in the flow of energy, life force through the body, prana, etc. There's, no, there's, no, there's really, under the, the normal system of development, there's no one huge big rush, you know, and something like that. So I hope that that gives you a, a little bit of a different frame uh, uh, for viewing it. It's to, it, it, it really is to activate the dormant regions of the brain and awaken the chakras, heal the chakras, stimulate the chakras. Most people's uh, chakras from the third chakra up are really not very active. 